spells in your show. Hello, hello Magic Family. Welcome to Spells. Good job, guys. All right, guys. Um, this is going to be actually kind of a cool video. Um, so if if you've been subscribed here, or if you've watched some of the videos, um, back, uh, it must have been about two months ago, we released a video where we opened up a box of Aether Revolt. Um, and in that box of Aether Revolt, please stop, um, is um, we opened up a token that had this white... Paste on it. Um, it almost looked like chalk. It came off. I had kind of scraped it off with my knife, um, and I kind of let it go for a couple of days. Um, eventually, my curiosity got the better of me, so I emailed Wizards and I was like, "Hey, like, what is this product? I've never, I've never opened anything like this and met with Magic before, um, and I'm genuinely curious to know kind of what what it is." I didn't ask for anything. I didn't complain. I was pure. It was purely curiosity. Stop, please, Bubba. Okay. Um, and they replied pretty quickly. Um, we kind of back and forth, back and forth. Um, so I guess what it is is what that product was. Is they sh they spray it in between the sheets of unprinted cards, so the sheets don't stick together. So it's almost like a talcum powder, I guess, kind of material, which explains why it was so hard to get off of my playmat. Um, but um, I guess this it was just a random printing error, um, and there was an issue with it, and um, so yeah, please stop. Um, so yeah, they, uh, they, but in one of the messages, oh, I love you, um, in one of the messages, they asked for my, my address and my name and the link to the video and, and all these things, obviously all these things to make sure I guess it was correct. Um, so yeah, once they watched the video and they saw me open up this token with the, uh, the gunk on it, um, they said that something was in the mail for me. Once again, didn't ask for anything, didn't expect anything. Um, I definitely wasn't out there to, out to, you know, to, to, you know, to, uh, to get anything out of it. It was purely curiosity. But today I come home from work. Uh, I've cut out my my uh, my address, so you guys because I can't see where I live, um, but you can still hear here. I don't know if you can read it. Let's see if I can get it close to the camera. So it's from uh, Paul Klingenbeard uh, at Hasbro in uh, Renton, Washington. So yeah, um, What's Washington, Washington in the well, U.S. Uh, and it's labeled as game Washington. cards. You've been there too. So you've been to Washington. Yeah. We've, we've all you guys have both been to Washington we, when we went yeah. when we went down south. So, anyways, so we're gonna delve in here. We're gonna see kind of what is in here because yeah. I honestly have no idea. This is the first time I've opened up this box. You can, I'll show you guys this side too. Um, that it it hasn't been opened. There's been no separation. You guys are seeing this for the first time, just as I am. So, yeah. with no further ado, um, let's crack in here. So, as a letter. And the letter says, uh, Greetings, thank you for taking time to contact us. In close, you will find replacements for your missing and defective product. We apologize for the inconvenience. Um, and this, this has caused you. Thank you so much for your support. Sincerely, Noah M. Product Replacement, Wizards of the Coast. Pretty cool. Um, I'm definitely going to have to hold on to that. So that's, that's pretty cool. I've never, uh, once again, I've never... I want that. No, no, I'm going to keep that. So, if we open this up, it looks like, ooh, so not only, whoopsie, sorry for the shaky camera, did we get a box of Aether Revolt, but looks like, here, I'm going to put this kind of right there so it's still in camera, but it also looks, oh, there's two things, there's another letter down here, uh, maybe it's the same letter, they just put it on both sides. Um, and bubble wrap. Okay. So this looks like. Can you hold on to that, buddy? Can you put that on the table, on the chair? It looks like they. I'm gonna see this uh, letter first. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Same. Same letter. Okay. So two letters of the same thing. I guess if you open it up on one side rather than the other. Um, but we also got a very oh, oh very that? cool, an Aether Revolt Champion playmat. How cool is that, guys? That's lucky. Thank you, uh, thank you so much, Wizards. Um, Let's write them a, a, a card back. Oh, I'm definitely gonna have to write them an email thanking them for uh, thank, for for, thank for this. You, I mean, this thank is you awesome. For this playmat. Yes. 
Um, so yeah, that we got Johnny Playmate. That is very cool. Hi, mommy. Hi, everybody. Hi. You, mommy's never been on a video. Johnny, that's so cool. I said hello a few times. Did you? Yeah. Okay. But that yeah, so we so got cool. we got an eight hundred volt hey, hey, magic. Guys, yes. Guys, yes. I've got an idea. How about every um? How about every time we do a video, we can use this map? I think that's a great idea. I think this that's is gonna have to be our new video, our new yes. video map. Yeah. So we're gonna roll this up for now. Um, so I, I, I really, once again, I, I wasn't reaching out for a product or to complain or do anything like that. I was simply asking a question. Um, and to, to, no, thank you. No, that's a knife and you don't deal with those because you're not an adult. So, let's crack into this box of Aether Revolts. Oh, Dad, can I rip off the plastic? Just can you wait till I cut it open with a knife. I want to make sure I'm very safe with this around you guys. Why? Because it's a knife and it's very sharp, even though it's not showing as of right now. Okay, um, just wait, this. wait, please, sir. Okay, you guys can go. All right. Got it. Sister, do you want to open this up? Mom, uh, mommy, can I give you the knife? Yeah. Thank you very much. So. Oh, All right, guys. So we're gonna open these up now. It is getting close to bedtime, and the kids do want to go play a little bit of Wii U. Kids want to go play a little bit of Mario 3D World. So we're not gonna spend a whole lot of time opening up this product, going through everything. Wait, we're just gonna rush, 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 it's gonna be a little bit of a speedy video, yeah, because obviously we're already uh, six minutes in, um, and we haven't opened any product yet because we've been talking. So, but nonetheless, I really wanted to do this video for you guys because. Um, Obviously, um, I would imagine this doesn't happen very often, um, but in the case that it does, it's good to know that a company like Wizards, who didn't need to do anything, um, took out took the initiative to uh, to kind of help out the you know help out the little guy. Um, please stop bumping the table. You're shaking the camera. Okay. What did you want to say, son? Um, thank you for the play, Matt. <laughs> cool. All right. Wizards. So we're gonna. Commons. Love you. Storm's expertise. Storm's expertise. Who knows? Maybe we'll get a. Uh, Those foil thing. Maybe we'll get a special card. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe uh, they sent us a super lottery? special box. Lottery. Is there lotteries in this? Uh. Oh, yeah, I think there is. I oh. Yep. There is. Took me a second to try and remember. It's been a while since we've opened. Uh, Please stop humping the table, you're shaking the camera. Um, what is it for those cards in there? Oh, they're, those ones are just extra ones. If you want, yeah. you can have those ones. Oh, oh, oh I need more land. Oh, oh, and a foil mobile garrison. So Ooh, there you go. I don't want these. Just, Thank just, you, wizards. Oh, Thank you guys, for please, the stop, please stop. Please stop shaking the table. You just be careful of the table, okay? Oop, that's, oh. That was me. <laughs> oh, sorry. I think I, to, I think I need to buy a a better a better stand. stand, more of a tripod. This one's kind of one of those. Um, one where you have to like twist it. And... Um, yeah, it's kind of got like an adjustable adjustable kind of cord neck cord thing. I guess I don't know how you explain. It's just like a almost like a snake cord, like you would use to clear out your drains. So. Which cards are Oh, is that if the song is on? You guys watching Storks? Yep. Yeah. Please be careful, sister. Oh, fatal push. It's a fatal push. Oh, there we are. A fatal push. What are fatal pushes? It's a card. Fatal. Yep. Now they call me if I want one of these. Okay. Hmm. What's going on around here? Foil welder automaton. So two foil commons so far. Oh, yeah. Nothing really uh, in the the expensive um, rare slot yet. I'm gonna I guess move this up a little bit. I just looked nope. at the camera. I'm gonna move kind of. I'll put commons there because they're still in frame. Foil. On commons, we'll do kind of. Uh, we'll do foils right there. We'll get, if we get any, when you get any mythics, we'll do them there. Uh, and then kind of more rares and the really good uncommons. So yeah. Like like this the 
that light bulb all the way across the world. So you guys almost excited to be done with school? Yeah, yeah. My Rainbow Rampager. Um, yeah, you guys are. You guys only have what? What? One week left? Yep. One week. Five. Five. five <laughs> Mommy's like five days. Right, because yeah, she you go a few more days than she does. Yeah. Um, yes. Brawl Chief of Compliance, Foil Alley Strangler. Ooh. I'm That's three. Our, you are three. That's our third common. That's our third common. Yep. I thought that was N. Nope. I thought that was UN. Carries of expertise. Oh, Foil Rare. Blech. Oath of a Johnny. <laughs> Why'd you say that? Uh, it's not a good rare and a regular non-foil, but for that to be hopefully not our only foil rare in the box, it's not overly impressive. But once again, you know what? This box is free. <laughs> I can't. Uh, what, I can't really. It? No, they gave it. They gave it to me, which is which is the crazy thing. I think this allows a couple of bucks still. Please stop moving. Oh, are you okay? So. Because you guys were having tacos and you guys like ketchup in your tacos. Uh, why is there a golden watermelon? Oh, crazy. This is so silly. All right. In an entourage. Nothing. Uh, nothing really of note yet. Nothing crazy. We'll see. Maybe we'll get a. Uh, we'll get an invention. I'm shaking the table. I'm going to give those cards to. You. No, thank you. Like I said, oh, there's a walking ballista. That's a couple of bucks. It's one of the the better. But we also have a foil one. Not not foil walking ballista. Yeah. No. Oh. That's a foil oath of a judge. Sister, please stop shaking the table. Okay. okay. Thank you. Yeah, but we have a foil of that, and that's the same thing. I think I just threw them right here. Mm -hmm. Daddy, we do Petrol have it. We do have it in the. Foil. No, that's a mobile garrison. It's not the same thing. Yeah. It looks the same. It does look very similar. All right, guys. Oh, hold on a second. The, the camera changed angles here. I think I'm going to have to adjust this because the guys keep shaking the table. So sorry about that, guys. I realized that the, the video went from this way to this way. It's now back to this way because the, the camera got tweaked. So that's another reason why we don't want to shake the table is it messes with the camera. So I apologize, guys. Uh, you don't, you didn't miss anything. Um, I don't think. <laughs> so we did get the walking ballista. Um, I guess. Well, what am I doing? The the video didn't discontinue. The just the 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 uh, aspect of it changed. All right, so carry Zev. One more. Then still, we have. We still haven't got one mythic yet. Actually. Daddy, daddy. Yes, sister. Can I tell you something? Um. One no, more, we'll save the rest for tomorrow. No, we're going to do it all right now what? to get it out of the way. Uh, there's 36 packs, basically. Yep, that's Ooh. correct. No, there's 35. Uh. Still, we've, we've gone through uh, almost about half the box now and not one single mythic. But you know what, if I remember correctly, most of the, most of the uh, Aether Revolt that I've opened... Or that we've opened, I should say. Um, a lot of the mythics tend to be in one column. Yeah. Remember, remember we, we, yeah, like two but, boxes we yeah, opened. It was four like mythics. Four, four mythics, mythics, but they were like three were in one column, and one was in the other one of the other columns. It was very very one, random. One was in. Four was. Four, show where the four, the four one was, please. Hmm? Solemn recruit. The piles are getting a little bit messy here, but that's okay. So, yeah, I think uh, I think I'm gonna have to upgrade the uh, the power. No, the, uh, the the way the camera's held. Ooh, paradox engine. There's our first mythic. I'll put it with the foil rare. Dun. Please stop shaking the table, sister. Please stop. Okay. If you if you keep shaking it, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave the table. But I want you to be here with me while we're doing these videos. Okay? Yep. 
Peace Walker Colossus, Foil Alley Evasion. So, what was the best part of your day, brother? Um, Other than doing this, obviously. Hmm. Oh, we got an Ajani. And, oh, another foil rare that's not very good. <laughs> uh, so we're going to put, uh, we'll put the Mythics over here. We'll put our second foil uh, junk rare over here. That's very funny to me. So actually, you know what? We'll put the we'll put the mythic there. So so far, a Johnny and a Paradox Engine, uh, one Fatal Push, pretty good. Like engine. Merchant stock and actually, you know, what? I think out of all the other most of the most of the recent boxes that we've opened, I think we got at least one a Johnny and one Tezzeret. Yeah. Tezzer Tezzeret. Why? Why do I keep thinking it's the one from like uh, the Tesseract from Avengers? Um, so we got a Winding Constrictor. And we got a Rishkar, which is another one of the some of the better rares. But not foil, Mama. So we have, a, we have those three. We got oh, we got a metallic mimic, another one of the couple of dollar cards from the set. <laughs> oh, another mythic Aetherwind Basker. What? Um, I'll put this out to the to the. Uh, the people out there, what do you guys think about the um, Ixalan leak that uh, that came out? I guess uh, somebody at, somebody at work today was came out to me, came running as soon as I got to the office, and was like, "Did you see the leak? Did you see the leak? Did you see the leak?" And I'm like, "What Ixalan leak are you talking about?" And he's like, "Somebody took a picture of the entire uh, rare and mythic sheets of of for, for the set that hasn't even come out yet. It's two sets from now." Um, so. <laughs> I, uh, that was lucky. Well, that was silly because that person no longer has a job. Why? I mean, well, well, because that's that's um, I would against company policy up at Wizards. If I'm not, if I'm wrong, guys, please let me know. <laughs> uh, but I would imagine, uh, oh, foil reverse engineer. Um, but uh, yeah, be, being able to release things, I, maybe one or two cards a month or two before release is understandable. Or you know how they did it with the Nickel Bolas. Um, oh, Nicole Ball is the... You have the, that. The, yes. That. Well, not not the new one, obviously, because the new set doesn't come out yet. But, um, but yeah, so... Why um, is the... I have the uh, triangle one. Oh, you're talking about the dice? Yeah. Yes, the dice from uh, yeah, the pre-release. Yes, you absolutely do. But, uh, but yeah, what do you guys think of... Um, think of the, uh, the, the leaks... Um, I mean that's that's a pretty uh, that's a pretty big thing to happen in Magic. That doesn't happen very often. I mean that things to get leaked that early. I mean that kind of reminds me of uh, maybe the original the original X Men movie that got leaked pre CGI like months before it ever before it came out. Um, oh, another mythic. We got an Exquisite Archangel or Archangel, I should say. Um, so yeah, it's, uh, it's crazy. I mean, it's nice to see that we're going to have dinosaurs in the game and pirates and dinosaurs versus pirates in that set. Um, and we're going to be having the, please stop. Can I go? Sure. If you want to go, go. That's fine. Okay, to you. Um, so yeah, being able to get back like the, um, the Sun Petal Groves and Root Band Craig, um, uh, land set and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. So, oh, I guess I should open it up on camera. So yeah, guys. Um, so I just kind of there we go. What um, I do want to give a shout out once again to uh, to Stubborn Salmon. If you're watching the video, man, uh, huge thumbs up, man. I, I appreciate you uh, being able to give me that shout out, being able to get you know a couple more subs and. 
and things like that. Uh, I hope, once again, I hope you really do enjoy that uh, that package that I sent you. I think you and your uh, you and your viewers are going to enjoy it. At least I hope you do. So, um, all right. So, almost done here. We got a quick Smith spy. So we got two packs left. Don't get me wrong. I love gaining free magic cards, but if I got a free magic card box with a invocator or um, with a lottery card, it'd be even better. We got another winding constrictor. Uh, life life crashers bestiary. Nice. Fo uh, another foil uncommon. Renegade rallier. Last pack. Last pack. Please, please tell me there's gonna be something good like another mythic. Another mythic would be good. We got four so far, so which just seems to be the average for uh, Three. for these boxes. Oh, no, four, four, four. Uh, a whir of invention. That's all right. Okay, guys. Well, you know what? I, I want to thank, first of all, you guys for obviously tuning in, uh, being able to watch these videos. And uh, sorry it took 20 minutes. <laughs> I just looked at the clock and realized it's been a 20-minute video, but it's uh, 21 now. But uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, obviously, I want to give a huge thanks to Wizards. Um, for making this video possible. Obviously, you guys didn't need to do anything. Um, and you managed to send me out not only a box, rather than a single pack, that technically, I guess, could have covered it. Um, but not only you sent me that, but you sent me a, a playmat, which is awesome. Um, so, and we're going to use that kind of from now on as our, uh, as our base because um, I lost the blue one. I don't know where the blue one went. It went somewhere in the house, and we had to be able to use the orange one. So from now on, we're going to be using the um, the uh, the Johnny Playmat. So once again, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Um, please subscribe, share, like the videos. Um, I got more coming out very, very soon. I think I'm going to be doing um, either a live stream or some sort of video from uh, Hour of Devastation pre-release. Um, 